So today is the final day. Gonna be heading to the airport in a couple hours. Gonna go visit my other grandparents slash neighbors one last time before I go. Hey, going, Becky. How you doing? How are you, ma'am? How you doing? Good, good. We got a big old bag of cat food for you. <laughs> okay, we'll do something with it. Yeah, yeah, give me a hug. Well, I don't know. I'll fall over. Okay. Hi, <laughs> right, Grandad. Oh, I'm gonna miss you. Got my good friend Greg helping me out again today. He's gonna give me a ride to the airport. It's a little chilly out today. This is Greg, everybody. I don't think he's ever been featured. I want everybody to meet Greg. Greg and I have been friends for about seven, eight years. This is one of the most helpful people I know. Very, very good friend. Love this guy. Love you too, buddy. What are you gonna do with Montgomery, man? Without Rowdy hanging around. Be sad for a little bit. Now I'm gonna watch your YouTube blow up. That's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> Probably coming to Colorado at some point, you think? We'll come to Colorado, yeah. I'm trying to only take one book bag, my chair, and Sam, but my book bag with everything in it, it has to be at least 30 pounds. Also, I've never actually worn my nub shoes and ridden in my chair at the same time. Ooh. Okay, that's, that is different, but uh, it's actually not bad. I was more worried about my nubs, like trying to poke out more. So that's comforting to know. Come on, okay. Come on, Sam. Come on. Oh, come on, Sam. We gotta go to the airport. We're gonna have fun. We're gonna my travel, buddy. Alright. Bye. We are on our way to the airport. This is gonna be a long day for Sam the cat. Uh -huh. Got my heavy book bag on the back. Oh shoot. Yeah, this is gonna be tough. Hopefully Sam can help me out here. Yeah. Alright. Now I'm gonna get lots of help at airports I usually do. So if I was by myself, I'd have to like hold it, I guess. And then go. Well I guess I could. Go into the airport. Oh cool, Circwest set up a Red Tails information station at the airport. Circwest, Red Tails. Sam and I just have to go through security and we're all set. Alright, Sam and I made it through security. And uh, well, it was kind of a breeze. Now we're just waiting at the gate for our flight. Per instruction, I got Sam tucked away underneath the seat in front of me. Once I arrived to my layover in Dallas, the airport assigned someone to, uh, to help me get to my next flight. Basically, the attendant pushed me while I held Sam the cat. It was actually a pretty long way. There's no way I would have made it on time without assistance. This is our last flight, Sam. Next stop, Colorado. We get to see you on it. Colorado. Sam and I just got picked up from the airport. So now we're trying to race to the apartment as quickly as we can because Sam is starving, I'm starving. Don't squeeze her too hard, she probably has to pee. Alright, let's show her the litter box. Oh, oh, she looks so concerned. Oh, she is distraught. Oh, she's going in the bedroom. No interest. Well, let's set up some food in the water. Yeah. Sam and I made it to Denver. But you traveled halfway across the country. What a sacrifice, Sam. You're a true hero. Uh, I'm just looking out my balcony. I didn't see any of this last night because it was too dark when we got in. But, uh, pretty nice view.
Stay tuned to find out how we all adjust to our new Colorado lives. That's going to do it for this one. I'll catch you guys next time. Saw my cousin Aaron one last time before I left. Uh, I can't bend him back though, that's the thing. <laughs> Here's a little treat for all of you that were wondering about how good I would be at arm wrestling. <laughs> <laughs> Down, man. <laughs>